Michelangelo was considered the greatest artist in his lifetime and held to be the greatest artist of all time. It took him four years to complete the largest painting project of his time. The ceiling of the Sistine's Chapel comprised of many frescoes from the creation of Adam and Eve, expulsion from the garden, and Old Testament scenes. Also the largest sculpture that Michelangelo created, entitled David, reaching a height of over 17 feet, located in Florence, Italy. Vincent van Gogh, a Dutch painter, created a large body of canvas paintings in his short career. His passing was in 1890. Many years after his death, his paintings were considered some of the most valued and celebrated works of its kind. Keith Haring, he was driven as a visual artist to create in the moment based on a retrospective activism movement. His subject was people, portrayed in a very colorful and adolescent expression. During his career, he painted for many years, adding to the substantial body of works. During the 1980s and 90s, the AIDS epidemic took many lives, including his in 1990. Claude Monet, born in 1840, Paris, France, a member of the Impressionistic movement in the later 1800s. He was the founder of the French Impressionistic painting, the most consistent and prolific practitioners of the movement's philosophy of expressing one's perceptions using many scenes in nature especially as applied to the plain air landscape paintings. He continued to paint his way into the 20th century until his passing in 1926. His techniques as a gifted painter was apparent in how he rendered oil paint from a brush to the canvas, creating landscape works of such realism. Pablo Picasso, his tribe of wives and mistresses inspired his passion to paint in the early years of his career. The Blue Period, the Rose Period, the African Period, Cubism, Neoclassism, Surrealism, and his later works, a span of 79 years. Salvador Dali, many painting series he created, such as The Garden of Mines, Melting Clocks, and others. Dolly produced many series, some of the largest canvas works, which in his later works depicted his wife, Gala. Dolly also was known to stretch his imagination and revered as one of the most expressive artists during the 20th century. The value of his art greatly increased up until his passing in 1989. Andy Warhol's life spanned seven decades, and within that time, he, like many artists, went in various directions in the creative spirit. He later discovered his calling, referred as pop art, he depicted many celebrity subjects and some products building his identity. His reputation as a prolific artist surged, as did his color in flamboyant lifestyle, surrounded by celebrities. During the height of his career, he gained fame and notoriety until his passing in 1987. Henry Matisse, the master artist, the conquest of color, expressed many times over in his large body of paintings 
and sketches. His art represents an evolution of expression in color, texture, and subject. Today, his work is highly valued and considered very collectible. Even many years after his passing in 1954, These artists are just some of the many that lived, created, and left a visual journal. The creative spirit lives on, a spirit that empowers an artist to create from the expression of the soul. Art tells us the vision of the past as history and continues on a journey into the future. The expression of art is a visual sense that speaks from its impressions of beauty and darkness. The history of humankind is what it represents. Let's replace that darkness. Maybe artists are the real leaders. Let us focus on peace, love, and equality. We live in uncertain times. Thank you.